Today we are opening the newest set, Maximum Gold El Dorado. What's up guys, we're back with another epic video. Today we have Maximum Gold El Dorado, much anticipated set. There's a lot of epic reprints in here like Access Code Talker, like Verite, and of course some reprints from original cards like the Blue Eyes White Dragon from Legend of Blue Eyes, the Dark Magician from Legend of Blue Eyes, and an alternate art Red Eyes, which is what I really want to pull today besides the Access Code. All cards in this video will be given away, just like in the Burst of Destiny video. I've not announced that winner yet, but I will pretty soon. Let's get into this thing. This is all you get. You get this, and I don't know how many packs are inside, but this this was pretty expensive. Hopefully we will get some epic stuff for you guys. If you do want to enter that giveaway, make sure to like this video, be subscribed, let me know what card you want the most for me to pull and for you to win. Inside of that box, we have five of these epic looking, they kind of look like slabs or something. I don't know. These look awesome. I really like these. Let's take them one at a time. I think there's maybe like four-ish packs in here. I can't remember because gold is always a little bit different than everything else. They like to keep it unique. They like to keep it golden. Okay, that was bad. Well, that was bad. Inside we have... Yeah, it appears to be four packs. I think you still get two gold rares per pack or something. That's what it was last year. We will see. It's hard to believe that the original maximum gold was last year. It seems like it was not that long ago. Let's get into this and see if we can pull the legendary access code talker. Of course, that red eyes alternate art. I hope we can show you that today, guys. I don't know what the ratios are. I think access code is like a half print. So it's kind of like the blue eyes and dark magician last year. If you remember how hard those were to pull, not crazy hard, but they were harder. Okay, we're starting off with the ultimate conductor Tyranno. Okay, gold rare is looking nice. Let me know in the comments, do you like gold rare? Do you hate gold rare? I'm talking maximum gold rare. There's multiple different gold rares. You can let me know your opinion down below. We've got a baby Saurus, Code Talker, and Evelsar Dolka. That's a pretty low rare, a pretty low value one, but I think it's actually a pretty decent card. So right off the bat, we've got a couple of uh, not too exciting gold rares, but we've got another 19 packs to go. Let's see what you guys can win. Make sure to enter that giveaway if you guys want to win these cards. Trap Trick, nice. Ooh, the Weather Painter Snow, very nice. And a Twin Twisters. This is a very good card. That's a nice one. Upstar Goblin is in here. I forgot about that. Gold Letter Rare. That's a very nice reprint. Two more packs. Let's go. We have the Weather Thundery Canvas. Danger Nessie. Cyframe Lambda. Eldorado. Black Rose, the alternate art. That is beautiful. And Stri oh, Striker Dragon. Cool. Hey, that's nice. That is nice. What do you guys think about the alternate arts in this set? Especially Black Rose. What do you think? I think it looks good. I think I saw some people saying they did not like it, but it's a pretty cool card to me. Next pack. Can we pull that Access Code Talker? That's the big reprint everyone's looking for because it got so expensive. $160 for the original Secret Rare. Chamber Dragon made this is also a big reprint. This card was very expensive. Ooh, the Danger Bigfoot. Okay. Number, the number one, I don't know if I've ever seen this guy. Number one, the first number monster, I guess. Numeron Gate Akim. Is this really the first one? That's a random one. I feel like a big card like Utopia should be number one, but they're number 39 for some reason. Second box. Let's go. Let's grab our four packs here. Four more packs. So far, we have pulled decent. I think the Black Roses are coolest pull. I mean, some of these are actually pretty decent value. I don't know the exact prices right now because it's too early. Blue Eyes White Dragon. I don't know if this is short printed this time. It probably is, to be honest. That is a nice looking LOB art. Check out the centering though, man. The centering is absolutely terrible on this card, but wow, that is a nice looking card. Very good. And then Red Eyes Darkness Metal. This needed a reprint too. An alternate art, Darkness Metal. Hot Red Dragon Archfiend. Yes, you guys can finally go watch the auction series today, I think, and you will see that card put in some work. Let's go to the next one. Number four. So we got, oh, we rock some special to the Weather Painter Rainbow. Don't think this one's too relevant. Trap Trick. Exodia, the Forbidden One. You guys are going to have a chance to win some OG cards. Check this out. We've got Blue Eyes. We've got Exodia. Can we get that Red Eyes all art? That'd be awesome. Let's go. Let me, you guys, uh, if you want to let me know what you pull out of this set, check out my Twitter. Send me a tweet with some epic pulls. Oh, we got Mystic Mind. <laughs> Oh, Mystic Mind. Gotta love it. Okay, Frank Kurtz. Bow Wow Bark. Very nice. Numeron Calling. And the Invoke Macabre. This is a good one for Invoke decks. This card used to be super expensive back in the day. I remember. It still is kind of expensive, but I remember selling one for like 43 bucks, an unlimited copy that I pulled out of a mystery box. So, yeah, it, it goes back to a few years still being good. Elixir. Deep Sea Diva. That's a good reprint. Oh, we, we rucks and special right into the Conquistador of the Golden Land. That's a good Eldritch card. And a Magical Dimension. I hate how these are always in different spots. It's kind of cool, but it's also like, when's the foil coming? All right, box number three. We are about to enter the halfway point. 
Well, it's five, so, you know, two, two packs in will be the halfway point. All right, let's get our packs out. Four more packs. It feels like we've opened a lot of packs. We've only opened eight. <laughs> we will be doing a live stream eventually of this. However, they're not here yet because Sassy is, oh, unable to get them. But that's an invocation. Woo, that is a nice card. That's a good reprint. That's going to be a pretty valuable one still. Prank Kids Place. All right, Nimron Network. We've gotten some pretty good pulls. This set is loaded, guys. I don't know. What do you think? Is this set or Brothers of Legend better? They're both incredible. I think they're both pretty good. We've got a Salaman Great All Mirage C1, El Dorado, Prank Kids, Rocket, Scrap Chimera, and the Familiar Possessed Lina. Okay, cool. Two more packs of this third box out of five. Still got a ways to go. Can we pull the access card? Ooh, Rescue Cat, alternate art. I personally like the original art better. Not going to lie. Broken Line. We got the uh, the Zephyraxi and the Elvisor Lagia. Okay, that's the alt. Is that an alternate art? Cool. Pulled both of them, I think. No, we pulled Dolcat. Never mind. Okay, yeah, it's different. Okay, final pack of this one. Can we get it? Access code. Ooh, Danger Nessie again. Pretty good one. Cyverse Gadget. Prank gets me on MMU. And a Scrap Chimera again. They do have. It looks like they do have the. I've seen a couple of these already. The printing errors, aka the damage on the cards right off the bat. That's not a good sign. I thought maybe they would have fixed that by this year, but it doesn't look like they have. Two more mini boxes. Remember, you guys can win all these cards. Just simply subscribe to the channel, like the video, and let me know below which card you want the most out of here. Because that's, I mean, we're going for the good ones. So hopefully we will pull them for you. And uh, one of you guys can win it. All right, we are getting down towards the end now, but we still have eight more packs to go. A lot, I mean, 16 more gold rares. Good chance. We got the Numeron Chaos Ritual. That, look at the centering on these. Man, the quality control did not get much better here. I mean, it's still kind of nicked up. There's stuff way off center. So yeah, Black Rose Dragon again, that's nice. I don't think I've seen like a centered gold rare yet. Like they're all not centered. Signet Mining's in here too. Wow, that's a good one. A lot of good cards being reprinted. Cyframe Driver, another gold. Oh, no. another Ruxus Special. Chamber Dragon Maid, that's a very good one. Twin Twisters, another good one. Wait, wasn't that in the same pack before? No. Yeah. Okay, no, it wasn't. It wasn't. All right, two more packs. That's a pretty good pack though. Twin Twisters and Chamber Dragon Maid are both pretty valuable. White Dragon, Trap Trick, El Glitch the Mad, Golden Lord, Numeron Storm, and Ghost Mourner. They did put, I forgot that they put this one in here. It makes sense to go with the other um, hand traps. Very nice. Final pack of the fourth box. Then we go into the final box. Can we get access code? Exco Talker. We got the Rescue Cat again. Cool. We uh, Rux and Special, the Deep Sea Diva. Man, some of these gold rares are like just gold letter rares are really good. Cyframe Gear Gamma, another good card. Okay, we're doing pretty good so far. And the final Maximum Gold Eldorado box. Yeah, not a lot to open today, unfortunately, because these are just crazy expensive. These, I mean, just compared to regular booster boxes, these are very expensive. All right, the final four packs. Can we pull something epic in the last four? We will be opening more of this on the channel. Don't you worry, guys. Number three, Numeron Gate. We've got the Ghost... Oh, look at this. Alternate art. Ghost Mourner and Moonlit Chill. Looking into a lake and uh, looking at the moon's reflection. Interesting. That is... I've not seen that. And once again, check out how bad the centering is here. Wow, it's absolutely horrible. It's huge on this side and huge on the bottom. We've got a Trap Trick. Okay. Invoked Makaba. Yet again, look at the top is messed up. Then the centering is terrible. So unfortunately, quality control is not good yet again. It's kind of a bummer that that happens because I think the gold rare looks kind of cool. But when you couple it with always being messed up, that is not great. Not great. Ancient Gear Fusion, which might be good for, you know, the PSA graded market in the future that they're hard to pull. Oh, another Exodia, the Forbidden One. That one's actually, oh, that one is actually centered. Is this an access code? Are there any other links? Oh, an IP Mascarena. Okay, that's a pretty good one. That's a pretty good one. All right, an IP, our first time pulling that one. So we have now pulled a lot of the good cards. We've not pulled an access code though. However, you guys have a chance to win everything. Make sure you guys enter the giveaway. Here we go. Psy Frame Driver. The only problem is it's hard to see these gold names. Like if I like kind of move it at the right spot, you can't even read them. Evo, that's a good reprint. Elemental Hero Neos finally got another printing. This guy has been disrespected. This is, look at the centering. It's almost off the card. I guarantee some of these cards were printed off the card. So that'd be a cool re uh, misprint to actually get. So hopefully, I mean, you know, I'd take to pull that. Let's see. Prank Kids Lampsies. Elvulsar Lagia yet again. And then we got a Giant Rex. 
final pack of the opening. Kind of a shorter one compared to what I was hoping to do, but we will get more stuff. We got a lot coming for live stream, so we'll be doing that next week probably whenever we get them. Hopefully it's next week. We will see because there's a lot of delays with this set. I mean, obviously they had errors with the printing, and now they have errors shipping it. Just a lot of errors with this set in general, but hopefully that is just this set, not in the future. All right, Prim Math Mech Almerbation. Okay, I don't know about that guy. We have one more chance to pull access code. Old Elixir. We've got a Zephraxi. And finally. Cursed Elvland. Okay, that's a pretty cool card. We'll take that, and then... The, of the Golden Land. Very nice. Overall, I think we did pretty good. You guys have a chance to win a lot of the best cards in the set. Don't forget to enter that giveaway if you're interested in winning those cards. Also, shout out to TCG Trusted Cards, Tone Fo Show, Tomato Juice, Noah J, Hawaiian Yu-Gi-Oh, Stanley, Mike, Nancy, Mimic, Gecko. Thank you guys for supporting the channel, and I will see you guys next time. Peace.